Yum, yum! William Vaughn here with a quick introduction to Shader Tree Basics in Moto using a quick example of controlling the grout width attribute of a hex tile procedural texture. Start by adding a hex tile texture layer to the shader tree, change its projection type to UV map, and select the UV map from the set texture UV attribute. You can use the grout width attribute mini slider to uniformly adjust the thickness of the grout. If you'd like to randomize the grout width, add a multifractal layer, change the lower clip to 50%, and change the scale to half a meter. Drag the multifractal layer below the hex tiles layer, then drag it into the schematic view. Select the hex tile layer, right click on the grout width attribute, and choose Add Channel to Schematic. Connect the texture value output to the grout input. The multifractal is now controlling the grout width attribute of the hex tile texture layer. Adjusting attributes of the multifractal layer will directly affect the grout width. Create a new weight map with no initial value and add a value with the weight paintbrush. Create a new vertex map layer in the shader tree using the new weight map. Drag the layer under the hex tile layer and then into the schematic view. Connect the texture value output to the grout input. Adjust the weight map to your liking. Feel free to experiment using images and other procedural textures to explore the endless possibilities. Oh, look at the time.